one of my viewers told me to check this one out and uh, it's called I believe it's pronounced cuties so I got the cuties <laughs> anyways this one is a news bin downloader uh, for Usenet so if you know how to use Usenet then you know you know what to do but here's some of the settings here um, you know cuties basic stuff like where you want to save your folders some uh, dialogues and here are the connections basically your password and the server that you're connecting to um, programs here it just checks if you have all the, the you know the right programs installed like part 2 and on RAR. I guess I'm missing the 7 zip which I need to install later on uh, other stuff in here the priority this is I guess to you know not overwork your system when it's doing the verify and, and uh, repair and even extraction like you know you have bar files and it's a search display mode you know how do you want it to be displayed it's a shutdown here um, if you want to schedule it the plugins here uh, it's actually kind of useful you know they do have a uh, limiter if you know you're sharing connection with uh, other people in your family and you don't want to jack up the whole uh, bandwidth from them <laughs> you can limit it here so that's good right so you have to enable it though the other thing is the watch folder so let's say you you know you download all your NZB files in your download folder um, just point it to your download uh, directory and whenever you download an NZB file it will just uh, automatically load into the program so that's convenient any other stuff in here no not really um, so let's demonstrate this out here let me um, search for a file here let's just search for Ubuntu and if you want to download one, let's say I download. Um, well, I don't want to do use this this one here. Let's use another site. There we go. And um, just click on the NZB file, and then click on this sucker. And there you go. It should be loaded into uh, the program here, and it starts downloading. Uh, after it gets all the confirmation, checks your password and everything. So let's see if it starts here. What is this one? It's download Ubuntu 11 out of 4. Hell no. <laughs> Anyways, that's how it works. Uh, really nice. I, I really like it. And this is what I will be using if I'm on KDE. Uh, if I'm on, you know, the GNOME system, I use the other one that I talked about last time. All right. Anyways, try it out. Cooties.